A Northeast Portland man picks up bags and bags of litter around the city every week, but now he's having trouble finding a place to dump it all. KGW's Catherine Cook met him tonight on a litter walk, and Catherine, he's been doing this for a while now. Oh, for decades, Laurel, he's seeing more litter than ever now, especially around transient camps, but he could not possibly fit everything he picks up in his personal sized garbage can. But he says the city no longer lets him dump all that litter where he used to, in part because of those transient camps. Get that off for you so you can actually have a seat. No one pays Blaine Tyler to pick up litter around Northeast Portland. OK, dear, there you go. He just wants to make his community better. Up, 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 up. Sometimes it's just easier to pick it up with your hands. Armed with a trash picker and pull cart. And one energy drink. Blaine goes on litter missions at least three times a week. Fills up 10 bags sometimes. This is my life. This is what retirement is all about. A habit he started between calls as a Portland police officer. I Many was a day I had two or three bags in the trunk of my patrol car going up to Peabody at uh, North Kirby and chunking them in the dumpster there. Blaine says he had permission and no one batted an eyelash then. Now a private citizen, he says Peabot won't let him dump litter here anymore because it's reserved for a certain kind of trash. They said that they, they were dealing with a lot of transit camp cleanup. That was occupying almost all their space. I think they should let him do that. Absolutely. Many neighbors appreciate what Blaine's doing. I think it's incredible. Yeah, I think it's really cool. And, you know, it's not his trash, not his problem. He's just taking care of it, just making things better. If only he had a proper place to put it. You can only do so much with a couple of rolling cans. And there will always be more. <sighs> the city says they'll see what they can do while they sort out options. Blaine sorts out the recycling and hopes someone will help him help the city he loves. We're all in this together. A Peabot spokesperson says the city offers many options for people wanting to dispose of trash collected at transient camps. He says you can leave the bags there to be picked up or you can request a pickup through one point of contact. But right now they don't offer anything specific for people like Blaine Tyler who are picking up all of that litter all around the city. But maybe that will change, Laurel. Back to you.